Why are thousands of children killed and injured on the roads around the world every single day? Because not enough is being done. You, our leaders, need to listen and act. We are children. In the future, we may have a say. But right now, it is up to you to help us. Action needs to be taken as soon as possible, or many children won't have the chances to grow old enough to have their voices heard. A primary school pupil, Ijoma Uchechuku, reading the Child Declaration for Road Safety, which she also presented in written document to management of ITV and radio. Speaking of the 2015 Global Road Safety Week, Unit Commander of the FROSC Towgate Command, Adewale Amin, said this year's commemoration is about safety of children on the road. The United Nations observed that uh, on a daily basis, more than 500 children are being, being killed uh, uh, worldwide through, due to road traffic crashes. And this time around, the United Nations has deemed it fit that, look, the children should be the one to even cry out this time around so that we can listen to them. Always remember that the children have no full idea about vehicle. When you are getting close to the children, first think that the children are, they are senseless and drive very with extra care. Receiving the child declaration for road safety on behalf of management of ITV and radio, the manager programs, Sonny Duke Okosu, commended the FROSC for creating an avenue to highlight the safety of children. I want to use this opportunity to advise motorists generally to obey traffic rules and regulations. The traffic light that you find on the road is to protect you and to preserve your life. And remember, when you're using the road, it's not meant for you alone. The man behind you has as much rights to the road as you that is in front. So these are rules made to help us protect ourselves, to protect the road, and to protect other road users. The key to ensuring that there is safety on the road is for us to obey traffic rules and regulations. Other children also read safety measures for motorists. Safety first, safety always. Don't overload. Safety starts with us, but begins with you. Always maintain your vehicle. I would advise the drivers that they should have patience and allow the children to cross. And when they see children, they should take extraordinary care because they know they are truly their children. The theme for this year's Global Road Safety Week is Save Kids' Lives. Ikmomosa Ugiagbe reporting.